fall does not just mean football and color, colorful leaves, it's also college application season. WTVA's Michelle Martin went to Newside High School and spoke to one ambitious senior who pulled off a college admission jackpot. It's graduation season and a lot of seniors are stressing out right now about what their next step is going to be. But for one local high school senior, that's not a problem. I'm so excited to go. Marissa Gann is valedictorian of her class at New Site High School, and she plans to major in biology to be a doctor. She applied to 10 universities. Only one of those 10 rejected her application. But that disappointment washed away once she was accepted into the school of her dreams. Let's go Harvard. <laughs> and on a full ride. It was about $80,000. I'm so thankful that it's just going to be paid for. I don't have to worry about it. But she's got a lot going for her than just grades in high school. I'm a cheerleader. I'm in a lot of clubs here at school. Senior class president. I work at Scruggs. She's also making history right here at home. Awesome. It's amazing. So to have a student from Northeast Mississippi, Prentice County, I think it'd be the first student ever in Prentice County to attend Harvard University. So big, big, big news. But yet the odds were not in her favor. Harvard College admitted more than 1,000 applicants to the class of 2026. They were chosen from a pool of more than 60,000 applicants. Although that may seem like a lot, it's not. According to Harvard Crimson, this is the lowest acceptance rate in the school's history. But Marissa said once she got her acceptance letter, she knew her hard work had paid off. Her advice to others? Just because it seems unattainable does not mean it is unattainable. You have just as much potential as everybody else. You have just as much of a chance as everybody else. And you can't be scared of hard work. In Newsite, Michelle Martin, WTVA 9 News.